I'm not going to go super hard. I'll, I'll be like kind of chill. Today. Thank you. Go really fast. Yes, sir. But when you lean on a sled, it's not like a car. Don't lean or turn fast. The best thing is just to go straight. So it's like a quad. Yeah, just keep going. Uh, way tippier. Way tippier, yeah. Okay. I, I'm not going to go super hard. I'll, I'll be like kind of chill. I'm not going to go super hard. It's only back, or that's the only break? Yeah. All right, cool. Just go as fast as it <laughs> now <laughs> oh shoot this thing's really expensive i don't know what i did um i don't know what to do i think when i when i was like giving it more it wasn't spinning at all so i don't know what was happening but i really hope i didn't break it because it's not my toy should i just try to start it again let me make sure there's nothing like on fire yeah like i said i don't know what i did all I know is that I was going really freaking fast and all of a sudden there was a real loud pop and it scared the crap out of me. Hopefully it's okay, but I don't think it is. We can't push this anywhere. I think they're going to get something to come over. Yeah, this is not moving. What the heck is this? Is this, what, I don't know what this is. 
They're coming to get us. They're coming to get us. They're coming to save us right now. Hope they didn't break his toy. Hey man, I'm sorry if I broke your toy. I'm really sorry. Mike, I didn't try to break your toy, I swear. I really didn't. <laughs> I don't know what I did. Okay? Yeah, I'm good. But when I was going, like, it just like, it sounded like a snap. I don't know what it was, but then I was right here and I was hitting it, like trying to go and it wouldn't move. I can't go. I can't go anywhere. Oh, you turned it off? No, I did eventually. Cause it oh. went, it wouldn't go. Cause I was like. Besides the belt on this. Thing. Oh, I can see. See this? Yeah. That's belt. Oh. R.I.P. It scared me pretty bad. Oh shoot! Is that really expensive to fix? No. Okay, thank God. Thank you, Jesus. Sean came down. Oh my God. We destroyed the belt. R.I.P. All right. At one point, this was the belt that was making everything spin. It's, it's no longer a belt. We don't know what it is anymore, but we know it's toast. That thing exploded, man. I didn't even ever seen a belt do that. I haven't either. That's why I was like, dude, something's wrong. I didn't know how the, if these are belt driven or what. Seriously, I cannot tell you guys how nervous I just was because I, I, I don't know if you guys will be able to hear it, but while I was riding, I was, I was pinned 100%. I was going as fast as it would possibly go and all of a sudden I just hear a loud snap and I thought I ran something over and, and it, it bucked me up a little bit and it scared the crap out of me and I, but I kept the bar straight so that was cool I don't even know how fast I was going but I know that I was going as fast as it can possibly go which on here that says 200 200 kilometers I wasn't going 200 I don't think but I was pinned and we were mobbing and um my helmet was getting blown down and everything. Thankfully, I didn't I didn't buck myself forward. Obviously, like I'm still standing, but that could have been super, super bad. Because I don't know, I also didn't explain to you guys yet. We're in the snow right now, obviously. And this is a lake. Let me show you. See that right there? See that? That's ice. That's ice going down into the lake. And I'll show you guys here in just a minute. Now Mike's coming over. Mike's the guy that owns the toy. Hopefully he's not too pissed off at me. I'm sorry. Good. Don't worry. It's all good. So we're going to load her up in the truck. It did pull up. It's all good. Look at this guy, man. He's playing, man. Losing his mind. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> they call me Arctic Joe. <laughs> One, two, three. Here we go. Sorry again, man. Oh, no, don't worry, man. It's all good. Let's go to the normal camera and let's go play on the ice for a little bit. All right, you guys. So we're out here in the snow. This is Hudson. Hudson, you want to introduce no, yourself? I'm Marshall. Oh, Marshall. My bad. My bad, dude. That's Marshall. That's Hudson. Hudson's over there. This is Marshall. Marshall, do you want to say your Instagram or anything like that, dude? Um, I'm pretty sure it's Marshall. On You're pretty the sure teacher. it's. Yeah. You're it's pretty either, sure. It's either Marshall Scoot or Marshall Teacher. All right, we'll make sure we get it in there. We've gotten Seth. We've gotten Sawyer. We'll get Hudson over here. Hudson, you want to be in the vlog? Come here, dude. You want to give out your Instagram or anything like that? Yeah, at Hammerhead Hudson. Hammerhead Hudson. Oh. Yeah, all got it. Is we right here, <laughs> right there. Yeah. And if we also want a shout out. Oh, I do. <laughs> get it, get it, get it. Follow my Instagram, uh, J Avio4. See, we got it. So there's there's hot chocolate. Are you getting some hot chocolate too? Oh yeah, dude, I'm dead. Smart man, smart man. Look at my gloves, you guys. I look like a Ninja Turtle. Hold up. <laughs> Ninja Turtle here, life. Wait, dude. You hot chocolate. It might be like warm chocolate now. That's perfectly fine. <laughs> It's not lukewarm, it's hot. Oh god. I was expecting it to be somewhat warm. It's not warm, it's hot. Oh god. This is so much fun, you guys, because I've never played on a frozen lake like this ever. Never. And this is like I said, it's this entire thing. Like the entire thing that you guys can see right now that's white, that's all one giant lake. It's all frozen. And it's not frozen a little bit. It's frozen like it's 18 inches deep right now. The ice is. So here you guys look. Check it out. Like you guys, a lot of you guys that are watching this might be from Canada and you might think that I'm tripping out because this isn't that interesting to you, but this is so interesting to me. Oh, the boys. All right, see all that? See all the things right there? Those are all air bubbles, literally frozen solid. 
So gnarly. Hey, you guys are gonna show me what you got right now? <laughs> oh, he just found out like, oh, he's a pro, man. Look at him go. You did it faking! Oh, big spin. What? Oh my god! Oh god, oh god! Oh, I gotta get the selfie, bro. <laughs> Let me see your sled, Molly. Oh, pretty cool. All right, you guys. Well, my camera is getting too cold to even work right now. He's not liking this. He's not even focusing right now. So we're going to cruise back to the house, warm up, and I got to take all these big clothes off because I'm not used to this, but thank God for them because they kept me super warm. One last touch. <sighs> Bye. I love riding on these things. You feel like you're going so much faster than you're actually going. I just spit. Gross. Okay, so really quick, I just wanna say, so I'm at the airport right now, first of all, let's, let's get that out of the way. So I'm going home today, but I wanna say thank you to everybody that showed up to the meet and greet, um, to all of the camps that we did over at Wheel Scooter Shop. I had such a good time meeting a ton of the Canadian R-Dub Club members. Also, huge shout out to Wheel Scooter Shop and the Danchuk family for all their hospitality and um, just taking me into their house and letting me stay there and letting me come over to the shop and just basically making this entire trip and all of these videos, all of these Canadian and snow and cold videos and stuff like that possible. So huge shout out to them. So if you guys don't follow that, that um, Wheel Scooter Shop Instagram, go down, click one of the links that are in the description below. Find them, follow them, they're good people. Also, I do have a new set of bars on right now and a lot of you guys are commenting on my Instagram asking me why I have unions on right now. Well, I actually gave my old bars to Wheel Scooter Shop because they're gonna be doing a giveaway with them here in just a little while. So. Don't go over there looking for that giveaway yet, but they will be doing that here relatively soon. See, so yeah, I gave them those, I gave them the grips that came on them, but I took I took my barns, I took my clamp and stuff like that. So for those of you guys that are wondering if those came with them, they didn't. So they also have both of the wheels that I rode in the uh, during the whole camps, during the, the fire video. A lot of you guys saw when I lit my scooter wheels on fire, um, stuff like that. And they actually have those same wheels. And I got some different ones right now that I'm gonna be putting in the next video and trying those out. And um, so yeah, be on the lookout for that as well. I also want to apologize to Mike for breaking his snowmobile. Sorry about that, Mike. Hopefully, you're not uh, you're able to fix that thing with a uh, not a huge bill. Again, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy all these videos that um, Canada basically was able to supply. Um, all these different experiences and stuff like that we obviously cannot do in Southern California. So this was really interesting. It was a lot of fun, and I cannot wait to come back. All right, make sure. That's rude, man. That's rude. Alright, she's done. I don't know where I was talking about, but if you guys didn't see my last video, which was about me riding my um, scooter on an ice hockey rink, go over and check that one out as well. You can click like, up on one of these cards right here. And uh, Yep, that's pretty much it. I don't really have anything else to say other than like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. You guys know how to do that. You've been watching YouTube long enough to know exactly what to do at the end of the video. So, love you guys so much, and until next time... I'm out. Later.